<laughs> I'm so glad I got you on one of these. Oh, with your top. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't know why he did it. Just don't make me draw. Oh, yeah! Well, this is pretty cool. Seen that scene in Alan Partridge where he's got a crazy fan. That's what I feel like you've done here. This, I mean, this, this is, is very this cool. Is, this, is, this isn't my work. This... Hey, I'm Roman Kemp. And I'm Toby Brown. SkyQ have brought us together to chat about some of our favourite things that we like to watch, be it TV shows, films, music. We're going to be answering some questions and playing a bunch of crazy games. It's going to be a lot of fun. Strap yourselves in. Everything is controlled by these SkyQ cards. Clever. Terrible. Ooh. What have we got? Which three tracks made by YouTubers would you take to a desert island? I'm going to address the elephant in the room here. I don't know if I would take your... No, I'll take your track. I'll take your track because I like you and I like your brother as well. I right? was getting so nervous Just then. because I like you both, I think you're both nice guys and I think what you're doing is really good. And I think that it would be a miss of me to not put KSI Okay. JJ. Uh huh. Purely because I find it so weird that that's the same boy that I saw at 14 stand up in front of my chemistry class delivering a rap based on chemical equations. You were actually in the same class? Yeah, we are in the same class. Which song of his in particular would you take? Desert Island wise, he's got that song with Simba, Loose. Loose. And I would take I that really just like because that. I feel like that's a nice little Good vibe. Good vibe. I got my pina colada. Thank you very much. Yeah. Um, and the last one would be. Just because of the memories that it brings back for me is when Joe Weller did the, his World Cup song. I filmed the, that video. You didn't? Yeah. Like, and we went to Rio de Janeiro, like just me and him at like 19 years old. And I had to go you to- You filmed the World yeah, Cup song? Yeah, yeah. I introduced JJ and Joe. Toby. Name the best Netflix series you've ever watched. Okay, docu-series wise, I want to say Last Chance You. Have you seen that? Do you know what? That's one that like, I feel like I'm not cool enough to watch. <laughs> what do you mean? It's one of those things where like, I don't really know how American football works, but I'm just like, I'll watch it. Yeah, 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 no, no. <laughs> Have you seen The Haunting of Hill House? Yes. I don't like horrors, but that captivated me. There's a new one, Bly Manor. Really? It's like the second version. Terrifying, terrifying. What's the best series that I've ever watched? Making a Murderer. I haven't watched that, you know. It changed so much. People started doing documentaries that were like not solved yet. Do you know what I mean? And oh, now yeah, you see yeah, yeah, like yeah. unsolved mysteries and things like that. Got but you. that became a worldwide discussion topic. Mm. Okay. Turn, son. Right. Well, you have 30 seconds to rank these. Disney Pixar classics in order of favorite. 30 seconds. Ah, 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 okay, ah, all right. ah, okay. Up is going up there up somewhere. Is up there. Bugs yep. Life was yeah. around there. Good. Yep, good, good. Yeah, Wally, it's I love Wally. Wally's Wally. good, Wally's good. Toy well, Story, toy sorry, but yeah. Above up. Yes. You're not wrong. Monster Z. Above, above up, up as well, yeah. Yeah, definitely. Ratatouille. I'm not a fan of Ratatouille. Finding Nemo. Up. up. Ah! I actually think we've done all right. Toy Story is the go. Sorry, yeah. It's go yeah. straight away. Monster Zinc is so close to Toy Story. Mike Wazowski. I've got your baby work, Wazowski. Always watching. <laughs> I thought mine was good. I'm not even going to bother now. <laughs> <laughs> what have we got next? I don't know if you even need to answer this. Hmm? Toby, name your favorite radio station. When was the last time I listened to the radio? People still do that. Oh, oh no, 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 it's a no-brainer. I like to listen to this station because it helps me relax and chill out and focus on my work. Classic FM. You can just vibe out to classical tunes. Like, I don't even know the names of any of those songs, but they just get me in the zone. I, I'm with you at, at Classic. Mm -hmm. Those songs have been on rotation for so long. Mm -hmm. <laughs> do you know what I mean? Bark on the playlist has outdone Eminem. <laughs> And I like the way how they talk on Classic FM. It's like smooth. Okay, and now... This guy and his impression. If you haven't already poured the bath salts, <laughs> you have time, because this is a Mozart song that has an interlude of 23 minutes. 
You got the camera crew creasing, bro. <laughs> <laughs> favorite radio station. Obviously, I'm gonna have to say Capital because yeah, yeah, I, I do. I, do. Love I, I, love, I love my job, and it is my favorite. I, I go in there every day, and I laugh nonstop. So. And you do a great job. Yeah. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. Well, all right. Next one. You all go. Right. Oh. Who would your 90-day fiance be? Jodie Comer. I know you're watching this. I should be addressing this to Villanelle, her character in Killing Eve. She would be my 90-day fiance for sure. Okay, I think I got one. I think Go on, I got where one. Is it? Jennifer Lopez. What a woman. What a woman. Unreal. Have you seen, oh, what's that film? Hustlers. Yes. Have you seen Anaconda? J-Lo, Villanelle. Sorry, Jody. I think that's good. All right. This, I believe, is the last card. It's time for Disorderly. Oh, Disorderly. Oh, my God. Again. This is happening again. Look at the size of that remote. Look at these plinths. Look at this card. Welcome to Disorderly. Take it in turns to spin the wheel, which is this massive remote, and give clues to help the other person guess what's on your card. 30 seconds on the clock. Toby starts. Me first. All right. Anti-clockwise. Come on, come on. Just don't make me draw. Don't Ooh. make me draw. Oh, no, yes! Uh, okay. Draw. Why don't you want, why don't you like drawing? Because I suck at drawing. All right, okay. card. Right. 30 seconds. Go. What? Go. Uh, because let's see it, right? Uh, Face. Uh, uh, it could rhyme with space. Hand, hand, hand sandwich. Uh, uh, hand sandwich. Got a big I don't smile. know what else to draw. <laughs> uh, the world's smallest legs. Oh my God. They're just, they're just friends. You were, you were drawing friends? They're just friends. They're happy together. They're, they're, they're friends. They're friends. I mean, Central Perk, Smelly Cat. Could have been something you could have drawn. A turkey on someone's head. I'm disappointed. Just get it off. I'm upset. That was, that was rubbish. That was really bad. Gibberish! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bit of gibberish. All right. You ready? You got 30 seconds. French press sofa bill ear. French press sofa bill? French press sofa bill ear. Come on. French. Think. Think. French press sofa bill ear. Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. Yeah. Yes. Are you good at this? Yes. I think we're pretty good at that. High five. God. Oh. Roman and Toby, it's time to hear your spicy opinions. Um, are we... Oh. Oh. Ah. Welcome to Spicy Opinions. Guess if the opinion on the other person's card is a truth or a lie. Oh, okay. Loser of each round, it's a very spicy gummy bear, and you get to start. Toby, it's my opinion that Get Out was one of the most overrated movies in the last 10 years. Whose opinion is that, really? Mine. Why? Why it's is it overrated? One. It's a spicy one. I just didn't think it was that great. If anything, I think it was overrated. I really enjoyed Get Out. I watched it twice, like, in the first week. It... I'm gonna say that that is not your opinion, it's a lie. Well done. You got it wrong. I knew it. It's actually my opinion. I, th I think it was a very overrated film. I'm annoyed. Does that mean I have to take one of these? It means you're gonna have to take one of these. Spicy gummy bears. Let me know how they taste. That bowl looks like they've shredded your jumper. You leave my jumper out of this. Yeah. My turn. Okay, all right. It is my opinion that Stranger Things is boring. So boring, I didn't get past second episode. I've learned you don't like horrors. You're that person that's really annoying when you're watching something on TV and they're going, whoa, this wouldn't happen, this wouldn't happen, this wouldn't happen. Look how stupid that looks, look how stupid that looks. Why is her nose bleeding? Why has she got a shaved head? <laughs> so I think you're telling the truth. When you're saying she's got a shaved head, who are you talking about? Eleven. You don't know because you didn't watch it. Eleven. Eleven's actually one of my favourite characters in Stranger Things. Love her superpowers. Yeah. Pick up some gummy bears. It's a lie. I got him, ladies and gentlemen. We got him. You, you, you got like, him. so you actually like Stranger Things. I didn't watch Stranger Things until very recently. I waited for the hype to die so I could enjoy it for myself and not come up with a get out opinion of it. <laughs> oh my God, are you mad? <laughs> not spicy. <laughs> oh, 
make sure we get the clothes on. My mouth's already really shallow, but it's nothing horrible. <laughs> They're so rank. How many did you take? <laughs> we got any water? I'm so glad I got you on one of these. <laughs> I'm more impressed by your poker face than eating them. It's not a poker face. I can Good genuinely God. handle spice. What's wrong with your top? <laughs> the spice I'm impressed with. Whoever got these, well done. Good job. Rock, paper, scissors to neck the box. You're moving mad. You wouldn't neck the clock. No, 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 no. We can't risk that for you. We can't risk that for you. <laughs> don't do it, don't do it. I'm actually not joking, don't. This kid nearly died with three. He's dead, going all over the floor. You know what, that's enough, yeah? You're not touching that now. Oh, go, go, go. Oh, I don't know why he did oh, it. Oh, oh. I... Welcome back, buddy. Hiya. Here you go, you fancy one more? Oh, Nelly Furtado! Ooh, that buzzer means that's all we've got time for today. For everything you love, all in one place. Easy on Sky Q. Check out the links in the description below. Be sure to like and subscribe for more episodes, and we'll catch you guys in a bit. Peace.